This is Genevieve, a 57-foot cruiser stern narrowboat built by Liverpool Boats in 2007. And if I'm being completely honest, if I'd seen her without knowing the history, I'd have put her at one or two years old. She's so well looked after. She's been in the hands of the current owners for a year and a half. The previous owners spent an awful lot of care and attention on her, and the subsequent owners have too. She had a full hull survey in November 2017. She's had new batteries, a new inverter, the windows have been resealed, anodes are new, the diesel tank has been washed out and cleaned, the gearbox is new, she's shiny, and they've left her ready for sale. They've lived on her for the last year and a half, cruising every inch of the system. She's 57 feet, so goes anywhere, and she's been left with us You are in mint condition, nothing more to say. You'll see as we go through, She's fully equipped for long-term cruising or liverboard. The gas bottles in the forward locker here, that's a typical Liverpool gas lid, quite nice I think. Two 13 kilo bottles in there. The well deck measures 3 feet 8 inches long. Lovely glazed front doors. And the water tank's under here, that holds 430 odd litres. And the water pump is brand new, about a day ago actually. In we go to the boat. Lovely feel, she's fitted out an oak face ply with solid oak trim. There's a solid fuel stove there, that's a Beckton solid multi-fuel stove. In the corner here there's a wall mounted television, that's 24 inch Logic LED DVD combo and the stereos underneath in this cupboard. The floor's new as well, that's wood laminate. And down we go through the boat to the dinette area. L-shaped, demountable table. It's not currently set up to make into a double berth, but it would be the easiest thing in the world to do. And the storage under that dinette, of course, as well. The radiator you saw there, central heating is a Wabasto system fired by the diesel tank. That heats three radiators and a towel rail in the bathroom. Into the galley, some useful cupboards and drawers under the starboard side. There's a side hatch there in the galley as well. And the cooker's a Spinflow Midi Prima Mark III oven. Draw underneath, and the fridge underneath is a 12 volt Fridge Master Danfloss. Stainless steel sink and drainer with a huge cupboard underneath. Space to the left and space to the right. And the hob is to the right of it, that's a four four burner gas hob. That's spin flow as well with space underneath. Plenty of storage in here, everything you'd need. Very light this boat with all the windows and the side hatches. Down we go to the bathroom. The bathroom's fabulous. Big quadrant shower here. There's a light over, over the shower in there. The loser set for cassette. There's a spare cassette on board. There's a towel rail in here. And a nice corner sink countersunk into the vanity unit. There's a sliding door to the bathroom as well. Um, the bedroom is the aft cabin. The bed is six feet three inches long by four feet wide. Reading lights over the pillow end. Cupboards over. Lots of storage under the bed, actually. There's three drawers under, and behind those is further storage. The calorifiers in the cupboard at the end. We'll see that in a minute. There's lots of storage under there. And at the foot of the bed is a huge double wardrobe. There we go. And a lovely staircase leading out of the boat. Under the staircase is the inverter, the calorifiers there on the right. That's a three kilowatt inverter, Victron Multi Plus. That was new in 2017, December. So it's only just over a year old actually. And up here is another cupboard.
the engine is an Isuzu 35. It's squeaky clean in there. Absolutely pristine. And she starts on the button. And there's the view from the helmsman position. Lovely um, stern deck, 7 feet 10 inches long we've measured that. I haven't actually gone through the measurements of the, each room with you. They're on the brochure and the website. Head height in the boat, they were 6 foot 7. Classic Liverpool, very tall ceilings. And some quite nice woodwork detail on them. The bedroom while we're in it is um, 12 feet 3 inches long. The bathroom... Six foot four inches, the galley six foot six, and the saloon over 16 feet. So, there's a lot of space in this boat for a 57 foot boat, you can go anywhere, and it's a very, very comfortable, very presentable, and very tidy boat. She feels new. There we go, that's Genevieve for further photographs lots of them the price and a fully downloadable color brochure go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk